Welcome back to Amazing Websites Television, the show where intelligent people like you come find the tools to change the rules. So welcome back to the show. Today is uh, episode number 440 and this is going to be a very very interesting episode. We're going to be talking about SEO and now I think that it's time to we get started with the first section of the show which is going to be handy bookmarks. <laughs> Welcome back to Handy Bookmarks. Today we have a very, very interesting tools that I want to share with you. But before we do that, let me just get started with something that Facebook has just implemented that I think that you're going to find very interesting. Have a look. What's up, everybody? This is Rena Kripa Johnson with Buzz 60. Facebook's determined to keep up with Apple when it comes to being progressive around gay issues. A few weeks ago, Apple's super popular emojis added gay and lesbian couples to their emoticons. Now, Facebook's unveiled same-sex picture icons to accompany your relationship status. Before, when you updated your Facebook profile to married, a heterosexual couple would automatically appear on your timeline. Today, you can choose from three different couples, a man and a woman, two women, or two men. And just in time for Facebook co-founder Chris Hughes, wedding to his longtime boyfriend. How cute is that? The reason why I wanted to show you this video is because, of course, you can see how uh, companies are actually changing with time. I mean, Apple is changing with time, Facebook is changing with time, and I think we also have to change with time because, of course, there's lots of changes happening on the Internet right now. For example, we just experienced uh, Panda, we just experienced uh, Penguin, and all these changes from the algorithm from Google, and that's why it's so important that we are abreast with everything which is happening right now with SEO. Therefore, I want to show you some uh, very good resources and also what is actually happening with SEO right now have a look cool so I have something very very interesting uh, to share with you I do not know if you have heard of something called uh, social shares social shares or social signals are basically right now a big component of SEO and uh, actually this is one of the things that I want to really call, uh, uh, call your attention to uh, right now we are in the Facebook page from Starbucks and uh, if we can see, they have 30 million uh, people that like them. Uh, but I think what is more important than that is just the amount of uh, shares and likes that they are having uh, every time that they post something here on their page, which I think is very, very important for you to see. So now, for example, let me just give you this example. I mean, on this link that they shared, they had 310 reshares. And they, in this one, they have 58 reshares. And uh, in this one, they have 147 reshares, and in this one, they have 245 reshares. Now, very important. Remember, they have three, 30 million people, right? And uh, you will be saying, well, I mean, if I will have 30 million, I will also be having this amount of research. Well, the, the, the reshares, not research, reshares. And uh, I think it's very, very important that I actually call your attention to the following. Let's go to another page before actually I show you exactly how that works. And we can go to Southwest Airlines. Southwest also has uh, a lot of people. They have uh, 2,941,000 2, likes. So it's a lot of people. But also, for example, in this pi uh, uh, picture here, they have 17 reshares. In this picture here, they have uh, just this, just uh, that, uh, that uh, uh, American football. It's 180. 18 reshares, uh, 49 research for this picture. So we're also saying, yeah, we have a lot of people which are actually resharing, but of course that's because they have a lot of um, uh, fans or a lot of people that have liked their page. Now, let me just show you something very, very interesting. Uh, this is my page. I have about 5,000 
uh, over uh, plus people on my on my like page and let me just show you something very very interesting i just did share this picture here basically saying well you know i mean i don't i don't think this is funny i asked you for an ipad and they are giving me an ipad which obviously it's a, it's a wordplay but of course it's just a very stupid and silly picture well i got 89 reshares in one day now what happens after i have actually shared that um, uh, picture on on Facebook. Let me just show you my cloud score. Immediately went all the way higher up uh, to 61 from being 60, uh, 59. So it went almost uh, three points up. And uh, the reason why that happened was because I shared that picture. Now, one of the things that I started realizing is that right now, search engines and also um, uh, Facebook also is, in, is, is is giving tremendous value at the amount of um, amount of people which are actually liking what you're posting and also reposting what you are posting. And the funny thing is that most of these posts are, you know, these kind of really crazy and silly pictures. So the first, uh, the first uh, resource that I wanted to share with you is, uh, it's called quickmeme.com. So you can go to quickmeme.com and then you can see that they have all sorts of pictures where you can actually just type in whatever text you want and then you will be able to actually put them on uh, on Facebook. Now, this is a very, very interesting thing because obviously if you do this kind of sharing in Facebook, people are going to like it, people are going to reshare it and of course you're going to get a lot of popularity. Now, if you actually upload these pictures into your into your blog and actually create that link that link from your blog, you obviously are going to be getting a lot of very, very good linking juice uh, for your search engine uh, results. Here's another of those uh, great resources. It's called Meme Generator. So S M E M E M E Generator dot net, and you can also do the exact same thing. And that is obviously for the social signals. Now I'm going to give you three more great resources. Uh, one of them is called SERP IQ, and you can find it on SERPIQ.com, and this is the ultimate SEO research tool. It's absolutely fantastic. It's, it's of course, a paid uh, system, but you can just uh, write, try it for free. You will be able to check your competitors. You will be able to check very, very sophisticated data analysis, data graphs, all sorts of different things. So that's another great resource that I recommend to you on SEO. Now, here's another very, very powerful one. It's called SEOMoss.org forward slash tools. You can also try it for free for a little bit, but then afterwards you will have to pay and you will be able to uh, work with your campaigns. You will be able to check your keywords. You will be able to uh, do link analysis. You will be able to do on-page, off-page analysis, rank tracking, a lot of very, very interesting information. And the last uh, resource that I want to share with you on this video is Market Samurai. Market Samurai, I think, is also very, very powerful. But now, before we go into our next section of the show, I want to show you a couple of videos which I think you're going to find very, very interesting. The first video is the one from the sponsor of this show itself, which is called uh, SEOscheduler.us. And I want you to see this video because this is incredibly powerful. As soon as that video is over, there's going to be a second video of Google explaining to you what you need to do in order to, to have great resources on the search engines. Have a look. Hi, my name is Adam White. I'm the creator of SEO Scheduler. I used to own my own SEO company that ranked number one on Google for the term SEO services worldwide. I sold that company a few years ago and decided to spend my time developing a system that would allow anybody to optimize their website at a fraction of the cost that SEO companies are charging. And that's how SEO Scheduler was born. So how does SEO Scheduler work? It literally walks you through the process of optimizing your website step by step for the search engine. 